The following video is presented by EA Game Changers. Early access to this content is provided by EA and Fire Monkeys. Right, this time tomorrow on your mobile phone, if you play Need for Speed No Limits, there will be a new update for you lot and it features two things. One of them is a new car, the other is a new area that we could race on. But we haven't had a new area for a long time, I believe. But we get a new area, commemorate this car, commemorate the all new story that we're going to get first thing in this. And it's the only new special event for this um one update, and I will show it to you in a bit. But let's go here, show you what's in the new update. All new track opens its gate. First and foremost, new area is called BRX, Black Ridge International Airport. And it goes with the story that is followed in this special update. And I say this because like if you notice like how the track is, it literally feels like you're like driving in Bayview at the airport area in Bayview. So this is the new area and to comply with this new area, we're getting a new car, a new story. Dust Howlers are planning a heist. Yes, they're back Dust Howlers. You help them um, free Rook from the Renegade's control and you help them get his Koenigsegg one to one and you help them climb the leaderboard with the Hennessy Venom GT. And now you're helping them get some stash or some kit with this lovely Renault RS01. First time we're getting a Renault in this new in this racing game, first time we haven't ran in a while in Need for Speed, because the only Renault we got was the Megan and the Megan RS, but we haven't gotten the RS01 in any game, and yeah, so we're getting the RS01, and this should be very, very, very cool. Along with another fast specs, I'll get more onto that um, in the description. Let me just introduce the car now. It is in the super class. Yes, yes, showroom. Yes, yes, whatever. It is in the super class. So if I go down here, it is right next to the. Wow. Uh oh. So I know this is OP because it does like 1100, 1114 when tuned to the max. This is questionable it looks really cool and it does have a nissan gtr engine in the middle and fia regulations deemed it really too fast so they did have this one make and they did have to redo everything so that it could compete in the gt3 class but it had it had its own one make cup series so far because like fia deemed it really just too fast for like any racing but seeing it here it's next to the Mazda but well the Mazda is better tuned to the max than this this can do 1096 max 1099 max this is actually do 1074 max but it's in a super it's below the Jag this is questionable but Stranger things have happened. I wonder if it'll be actually really good. It might be really good. I will check it out in the next vid. I can't find this car series. I don't know if they forgot to add it or I'm just being blind. But I'll probably find it when I actually drive the car. I don't know if I'll be able to show you any of the new track. But we'll go from there. So I will definitely show you the car and how it compares to the other supers in the game. I might have some hopes for it because this is the best sports car. This might not be the best super, but I'm going to. Because best super now is Renault occupied by the Porsche 911 GT2 RS. This might not come anywhere close, but I think it'll be pretty fast. But anyway, I will show you this car off so what you can customize with it and you will go from there. So rate, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in the next vid.